We're back at Copenhagen Fashion Week. It's even greener and there's a lot of new things going on. Could you tell us about that? About the green initiatives, yes, there's, a, there's quite a few this time. Apart from that, we always drive electrical cars, so lowering our carbon footprint, LED lights and printing on environmentally friendly paper and stuff like that. We have, we have two things that we're focusing on this time. One is sustainable shopping. So we have made like a, a mapping of uh, shops in the city that sell different kinds of sustainable either fashion goods or lifestyle products. And, and it's, it's called The Green Walk and, uh, and it's available online and, and in our program. And then we've done another initiative called the Fashion Exchange. It's going to take place on the City Hall Square on Saturday in the afternoon. And we've invited all the citizens of Copenhagen to take some of all the fashion that they have in their wardrobes that they don't wear. And that's a lot. And normally people use only like two thirds of their wardrobe, if even that. And there's a lot of things that we've buy at impulse shopping or that we grew out of or somewhat, somewhat don't reuse and bring that into the city hall square and exchange it for something else. And in that sense, also teaching people that fashion has a value even though uh, it could have been on the landfill instead. Absolutely. Now, you said earlier you're st it still excites you being here every fashion season. <laughs> what, what's so exciting about it and why do you still love what you do? Well, I think, you know, a half a year of our lives, I'm at a desk, you know, doing, you know, administrative work, uh, emailing and stuff like that. And then it all... It, it all comes to life these days and, and you know, the culmination of, of, of hours and months of, of work uh, kind of comes to life and, I, and that just always thrills me. Absolutely. We just saw SKU Larsen, he opened it up. What, uh, what did you see and what did you love? We've chosen SKU Larsen as our opening show because he presents a, I think, new take on menswear. It's much more advanced. It's not about cardigans and t-shirts and suits or, you know, the, the normal, you know, the normal everyday wear for a man. I think he presents a, a masculine take that combines uh, punk and avant-garde and great prints and funny silhouettes and a lot of humor. And I think he, it would be such a more fun world to be in if we had more men on the streets looking like that. Thank you so much and enjoy the next couple of days. Thank you.